Hello everyone and welcome to Warfen's World and welcome to my let's play of Starpoint Gemini. So we took over this region which actually went well. I thought we were not gonna make it because they were damaging me a lot but we did make it in the end so that's perfect. And here we've got a forward outpost. Uh, I don't think we can actually Initiating sublight. dock with them. Or can we? We can get missions from them. So what we will do is we will go here Setting course. and get ourselves some missions. So we can build another junk reclaimer here. Perfect. So we are building up our economy already by a bit. We have 640,000 credits. So soon enough we'll be able to upgrade our ship to a is it frigate or corvette. I'm not sure. To leave our gunship behind. You can actually see the turrets moving as well. There's one over there, one here. HQ reports one of our fleets have returned. Alright, getting some resources from the fleet tasks. Uh, no salvage tasks around, unfortunately. I want to have some more of these materials. Concordia reporting in. All is well. Hello there. Perfect. Let's sell the stuff that we have. 652,000. We want to have 900,000. We could buy uh, this one here if we trade in our current ship. And then we get a freighter, uh, so we could do some trade runs. But I think I would rather not do that and go for something like this instead. So we will have to repair ourselves. Oh, we actually didn't get damaged. Cool. Let's see if there's a well-paying job. I guess we still need to do two jobs. We can do a time delivery, why not? Explore a little bit of the map in the meantime. Oh, that's not too far. Initiating sublight. Normally you'll run into some enemies though. Almost level 5. I th do we get money if we level up? I don't think so. I think that's in the campaign whenever you do a mission. And that tends to overlap with leveling up. What are you? Are you my... Why did you leave me? Come on. We still have some time remaining. But we should go straight to the destination nonetheless. Two minutes, 40 left to deliver our stuff, and it's 70,000 kilometers away, at least kilometers, I guess, or I guess it's not light years. Considering we're still going sublight. completed our assignment Yay. on time. Level 5. So then we will almost one more mission and then we can get ourselves a cool ship. So let us go back here. Realigning course. Engaging sublight. You're 72% done with building. Uh, I guess maybe we need a shipyard. Let's see. Up module. Hangar, yeah, we need a hangar. But those things still cost a fair amount of money. Do we do some researching? No, because we need a research module, yes. Three skill points. Alright, let's upgrade this one. And let's upgrade the decoy. 
At some point we also get a nuke, which is kind of nice. It does a lot of AoE damage and does more damage the far away, further away it is. At the moment we're using a lot of rail guns. Um, might be worth it. Then again, more boarding is also nice. I don't do any boarding yet. But once we get some actual manpower, because now we have 37 people in our ship. It's actually not too bad, but I guess we can only really board gunships. Which actually, if we find one, might be worth it. Because for us, like a gunship is, is not that worth that much, but for where we are in the game, it's actually maybe worth quite a bit. Let's see, when if we get attacked by something, we can actually have a look. Alrighty. Nika. Hey boss. What's up? Trace tells me that you're thinking of joining the Concord. She's in the main campaign. Yay! We get another War Master, so we can go with multiple people uh, hunting. Uh, shipyard. Ooh. Oh, this was level 4, so we can already get it. If we trade in our current ship, which is apparently worth about 100,000. Uh, let's do that. Yes. But then the thing is... Okay, 100,000. That's probably still enough. Because now we need to add our turrets here. By maximum and these turrets now don't have anything yet hey our heavy weapon did not get added why not oh here mount mm. so what we could do is we can see if we can buy some cool weapons but they tend to be fairly expensive as you can see so we'd have to do some more missions first so, I'm not sure completely about the difference between rail guns and beams and stuff. I mean, they do different damage to shields and stuff, I guess. But um, what we could do is we could kind of specialize. So if we go for REM2 here as well, we just mount one and then we just have a mining laser for now. Uh, but then it as soon as we do a mission, we will get enough money to get the rest so let's do a job uh insulation defense is kind of nice salvage let's do in insulation defense here this one here recommended level one to five should be fine so we have this ship here the winds of desolation join our fleet and then we will go right there once she joined us. HQ reports one of our fleets have returned. Engaging sub. Oh, that was a salvage mission. And then it disappeared. That's not fair. So we need a research hub and then we can research junk reclaimer too. So a research hub, what, what do we need for it? We need to have lots of ore for it and some materials. Um, I think we have a fair amount of income here. 400, yeah, so that's not too bad. The mountain blade in space. So she is in a corvette and you're in a frigate. Perfect. All right. We have arrived at the construction site. So here Most we have to repair these things. Operational, and some are beyond repair. So we should hurry up and transport our technicians to start repairs. We are transporting delicate repair Poor equipment. Poor fairly hard so to repair. To closer than usual for transport. 
Ah, this one repaired on the first go. That's quite rare. And we also only have a very li limited amount of time, as you can see, 30 seconds to repair a couple to help us with the incoming wave that will come. Repair failed, so I'm always try a second time. Doesn't always work. Failed again. But then I kind of go away because I also had one, for example, where I just stayed forever and then I had like 10 failures in a row. So I wonder, she also says that some are beyond repair basically. So I wonder if that was the case there. But now it worked on a second time. Oh, we're already being attacked. A ship rammed uh, the enemy right out of my missile or iron cannon. We're going down. The hull reports multiple breaches. Yeah, so it is all quite easy still. Trust me, it gets harder. Can I just get rid of these tutorials? Would be really nice. Hmm, how to save. I don't see it anywhere. But I mean, it's getting a bit. Maybe I just have to restart the game or something. Setting course. So this prison here we can actually board. Um, but I think they tend to be fairly hard, so let's not do that yet. Here is actually blue. We could go there and see what's up. Some stuff to sell. We've got some rearming to do, and then we can make our ship better. So we can add maybe another RM2 mounted there by the maximum, and here as well. And then at some point we can buy another heavy weapon, but now we don't have money for it. So we can go to the jobs board. Oh, actually, what I could do, I think I noticed last time um, when I was playing yesterday that Feneros actually had higher level missions than Concordia. I'm not sure if that's true here because I was playing the campaign. So we can actually land on this planet here and see what they have to do. Active chase view. We are landing on the planet. Here we go. Ship looks tiny like this. Um, so. Two hundred eighty. Two hundred eighty-two. Another installation defense. Salvage mission. Let's do this one. It says level eight, but... We have two ships with us. So I think we should be up to the task. And it's also super close by. That's quite nice.
Captain, the target is in our sight, so let's show them no mercy. Battle station. Repeat to the seven weeks. Alright, he's almost dead. Another mission completed, but there's always more work to be done. Let's salvage that target one. Target neutralized. So actually we are, well, I wouldn't say super strong, but we're somewhat strong. So maybe it would be worth at least checking out how strong the enemy is, for example, in regions like like here. Engaging sublight. They're probably fairly strong, but... Let's look at our ship from up close. Many more turrets this time. Or well, not many more, at least some more. I like this view though. It's a bit more easy to see what's happening. So in the meantime, we actually have a fair amount of resources. could build a research outpost but not yet um, also don't think it's really worth yet to look into that um, research and development what do we need still we still need a little bit of materials which are often a problem at the beginning of the game but in two weeks we'll have enough what we could do though is just engage these guys hostile region entered board one but uh, was not fast down. enough oh here's a radar relay let's Engage sublight. let's go for that one then we don't need to explore as much let's see if there's any missions for my civilian fleets but no <laughs> new tasks available This quest auto hides at next level. Okay, good to know. Automated repair facility. Ships. That should not be a problem for us. Go. Probably not gonna happen. 
Okay, bridge pacified. Oh no, I actually didn't see what kind of ship it was though. Mm. Oh, I can't use it anyway, so that's fine. So, salvage it for parts for 163 materials then. Now we just need to go to the relay satellite and hack it. Potentially fight more enemies? Probably not. Unless... Yeah, they can. Do quite a lot as well. Let's shoot and look at them. coming for me so let's not go there 2000 power I can't actually see what's in their fleet yet you can do research so that you can see it but I think we'll need a little bit more to be able to to do that so now we should be able to build that research thing research and development perfect so then we will scan this artifact thing and then I think I'll put the episode to a close. So we just need to scan it and then we get extra skill points and perk points. Initializing scan. There we go, skill point awarded. And there should also be a perk point awarded I think. We only have one, so we could do this gravity push, but I think I'll keep it. And we don't get any perk points, unfortunately. But I think I'll put the episode to a close here. I hope you had fun, and see you next time.